Hello, welcome to Doing Reviews episode. Eh. So this is part two of my Jean Arc cosplay. Part two, that part two, part one should um already be up. How about that? <laughs> Basically. So um yeah. So this was created by a lovely person on Etsy. Nerd nerds being creating. Um. It will, the the name and the shop and these items in particular will be in the description below. Uh, so yeah, and make sure if you're going to get because these are technically two different sets: the, the shield and the sword are two different sets. Like this is an item and this is an item. So if you're going to get them both, make sure you contact uh, nerds. What do you call them? Uh, nerds be nerds be in Creighton. And uh, tell them because they do give you a discount code for getting both. Because these are not cheap. As you can see, this can be fully put into the shield. Sword can fully be put into the shield. So, I don't know why I put it back in. Well, I was just going to take it back out. But I did. The main show that it can. So, this is what it looks like fully put together. This is for um, basically. <laughs> season uh, four onwards for Sword and Shield until the end of volume eight. I'm gonna switch between the same season and volume. I'm sorry, but and if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. Um, if you don't, then you'll have to go watch it. <laughs> Actually, I'm planning on doing a new media, but there will be more more episodes of it. So think about that. Um, so let's do this the shield first and I'm gonna do the sword because this is my hand. So as you can see, here's the sword. Same on both sides. As you can see, the I don't know what any of these parts are called. So I'm gonna make up some names. The line that goes right down the blade is here on both sides. As you can see. Um, all the detail on the hilt, I believe. Um, is there. You can see. Same thing with the tip of the handle. And the handle, as you can see, like, the, like I have a teenage, uh, like a 20-year-old man hand. And to, <laughs> to move my shoulder weird, like, I can comfortably fit both my hands on here. So, so, from what I've done before with sword-like items, I've uh, compared sizes. Uh, so I'm just gonna do that real quick. So, going off of our last few reviews, here's the Lightning Collection Dragon Dagger. Going to be put about at the same spot where it is. <laughs> and then uh, the sword that you get with uh, the Kamar Saber driver. But this does not matter for size. As you can see, again, it, it, this dwarfs both of them very easily. So it's like the part of the largest thing I have. Um, weapon wise, like probably most real world scale. Um, let me move these out of the way real quick. So. Here, again, here's the sword. Right. Again, nice handle. It's everything, looks real good. It even has all these right here. Okay. Like everything's solid. Obviously it's foam. It's not full metal sword. <laughs> um, you can see, it is a PVC pipe running through here. It's probably closer up to, I'd go like all the way up here-ish, to like the tip. I don't know how far it goes. I think that's PVC because you can kind of see where it indents right there. You can feel right there, it's a little hard. Plus, I mean, if it wasn't, it would probably be like flimsier. So, yeah. Same pretty much on both sides, so. I'm gonna put this off to the side right now. And now we're gonna look at this big wire, the shield. You can see Jean's logo is right here. Little 
Pura Tribute is down here. And yeah, it's nice, it's big. Like, again, here's my hand. And like, like you kind of see in the like, comparison with everything else, like, it's, the sword is taller, but not by much. Um, and yeah. Um, as you can see, the gold paint goes all the way around, way right down to there. And if you look at the back, gold paint's even on the back of here as well. And a little bit on top, around, the sides, and the tip. <laughs> um, and if you look, like, uh, it's pretty, pretty noticeable. Um, this part is way thicker, because, you know, that's where the, the sword goes. Slide it right down here. As you can see, there's little cutouts on both sides. As far as I know, there's not a certain way you're supposed to put the sword in, just in. Like, it can go in. You can see I'm turning the sword. Right back there. Yeah. In. There we go. And um, again, you can kind of, you see, but there is still a little bit of space in there. <laughs> Shove a one in there, a one dollar bill, or whatever your currency equals up to with a one paper bill. So as you can see, there are two straps on the back, one here, one here, one for your arm, one for your hand. Um, because again, my arm's a little thicker. I say again because I just reviewed the other part. Um, it's a little harder for my arm to go in, but here, this is not measured. Um, some other items, I did look through other items. Here, let me get the other side. I'm sorry, you have to. There we go. Oh, shocking, I'm on this side of the screen now. So, as you can see, it's a little tight right here. I can barely get you there, but again, the, because they didn't ask for measurements. But some of the items do, like they do gangs, gauntlets, and stuff, and that's one of the items where they do ask for. So, but that's just a me thing, and I you can probably easily just replace that, you know, cut it, make, make it a little bit bigger, make fun of it. I just like put a snap on it, and then, but I like it. As you can see, it's not moving. As you can see these little blocks are where these attach to, and make sure it stays down. Separately, I would recommend the sword over the shield. Purely, purely. Only reason why I say that. It's not because of the, the straps or anything. It's because if you get just the shield and you get like a sword from like somewhere else, because you know, it's a sword and shield combo, you would not get the sword. It might not fit in here. Then you have a whole other problem, you would have spent all this money. And then you have to buy another one or buy a different sword. Like buy the one that they supply. Um, but as a set, I say definitely pick them up. Um, they're a little exp it's, it's expensive. Um, that's why I'm very happy when um, I read and you contact them before you order. It says it's on the listings for both of these. I'm not like, giving away trade secrets. Um, to tell them that you're ordering those. So then they can give you a discount code. Because together with the discount code, came to almost five hundred dollars, and that's including the shipping. But as you can see, but that's mainly because like the shipping is a lot, because it's a very big. Like again, it's like it's my whole arm, <laughs> like from my armpit to the tip of my hand. Um, it's very big, very very big. Same thing with the sword. The sword's very tall, like, <laughs> as you can see, it's very tall. Like, it, like, the whole thing doesn't even fit in frame, as, like, with one worker with here. There we go. Um, so, one thing that I found amazing about getting from separate people, and even, I'm going to show one thing that's going to be in the next review as well. All of the gold... actually somewhat matches like i got this like a month after i or after i got these and like i i didn't 
and I made these like they are ordered this. You can see they're all very close. No contact between. Like I didn't tell them my color, and you know these two people never talked. So that's just amazing in my opinion. But that's probably just because he John uses one color and one color alone. So um, yeah. That's pretty much it for this. Um, again, the link to their whole Etsy shop. They they sell pretty much any of the Ruby weapons. Um, one I didn't see was like Romans, but like they they do talk about um, doing custom stuff. So I get that in the future. Um, and after we ordered this, we also got another discount code for you know, anything in their shop and stuff. For I assume that's only a one time. You said and then not get any more after that. But they were very awesome. This came, I would say, five days ago as of this recording of August 23rd. And we we were not sure where it was for a long time in the mail. Um, for like a few like for like almost a few days. And they they contacted um I'm I'm saying us because my mom thinkly ordered it. Um contacted us and told us basically if it doesn't show up within like by Monday of that week that it came Tuesday right um if we told them everything and there wasn't any updates you know of it being delivered the next day or something they'll they'll fully remake it and everything for free so yeah so I say definitely worth it 100% like again it's all pretty smooth for just big of a thing. Everything's pretty smooth and everything. You know, the logo's all good and everything. And I, I just think it's amazing. I mean, like the, the the shock, the most shocking thing is that this actually fits. So I got told that this is very hard to do, and I appreciate this so much. And yeah. yeah and um, because I have cats, I have to store the shield out in the ground or else the cats will will make this battle damage very quickly um but yeah i definitely recommend it 100 percent, 100 percent recommend um so if you have the money you have because like they got done very fast like it was like two weeks after we ordered it and they were working on it and it was being shipped soon after that so yeah 100 percent recommend and everything so yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, again, links for the whole shop, the shield and sword, because they're separate, separate listings. Um, everything will be in the description below. And um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And at least I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.